In this video, I'll show you how to use the Logos Clause search and find all the places in the Old Testament where God acts in relationship to His covenant. Imagine you're reading through Genesis 6, 13 through 21, and come across verse 18, where God establishes a covenant with Noah. Sensing that the idea of covenant is an important way that God relates to His people, I want to search the Old Testament for all the places where God acts in relationship to His covenant. Logos' powerful clause search tool allows me to quickly find this information. To begin, click the search icon and select the clause search type. Notice that the clause search allows me to search for anywhere people, places, or a thing appears in a clause. I can also search for semantic roles such as agent, patient, or experiencer, or even syntactical roles such as subject, object, and much more. Since we want to find all the places where God acts in relationship to a covenant, I'll begin by searching for subject colon God. Then right-click the word covenant and copy the Hebrew word berit. Then enter object dash lemma, followed by a colon. Then paste the Hebrew lemma. Logos returns 64 places where God performs some sort of action in relationship to the word covenant. As I scan through the hits, I find that God establishes a covenant with Noah in Genesis 6.18 then remembers the covenant he made with Noah in 9.14 and makes a new covenant with Abraham in 15.18-21. And in 2 Samuel 23.5, David reflects on the covenant God made with him and notice that Logos found results where God is not even mentioned by name in the original text, but is referred to simply with a pronoun or implied within the verb. But are there places where God acts negatively in relationship to his covenant? To find this information, simply type polarity, colon, negative into the clause search. With this search, Logos returns only seven results. In each of these results, we find quite the contrary to our expectations. We find that God does not forget, break, or destroy His covenant. Instead, His people petition Him not to forget His covenant or His vow to not violate His covenant. Finally, we can save the results of this search for later analysis by clicking the panel menu and selecting Save as Passage List. Now, going back to our search, if we want to explore how people make covenants with one another, run the search object dash lemma colon berit and not subject colon God, then analyze your results. To start using the Logos Claw search today, get Logos 6.